Cristina, ABC Action News. Great advice. Thanks, Rebecca. For months, you've been hearing about the economic stimulus package signed into law by President Barack Obama. Part of the $787 billion package includes improving the nation's infrastructure. The goal is to also create new jobs and stimulate the economy. Now for the Tampa Bay, we are seeing tangible evidence of and meeting someone who got a job because of it. Our Eric Waxler has a story from Hillsborough County. More than six months after she got laid off, this is Lisa Parati's first day. Bills and pay back the you know people who were able to help me. Lisa worked as a field office secretary with Hubbard Construction, but when they let her go in December, things got tough. She even had to move in with her sister just to get by. It was horrible. Um, it was right around Christmas, so it was just a really bad time. But now her bad time is over. Her old company is starting work on a $34 million project at Tampa International Airport, and they hired her back. The project is partially funded with $8 million in federal stimulus money. What we're doing is we've accelerated two projects. We combined them so as to create more employment for the Bay Area. We made a conscious decision to do that. Airport officials credit Congresswoman Kathy Castor with helping them secure the stimulus money. The two projects involve laying groundwork for a future terminal on TIA's north side. This taxiway will be replaced with a bridge connecting two runways. Chile is the project manager. We're excited about bringing experienced people back on, which we had to lay off earlier in the year. Uh, we're very excited about giving them an opportunity to get back to work and to work for us again. This project actually wasn't supposed to start for another three years, but thanks to the federal stimulus package, it is underway now. And officials tell me Lisa isn't the only one they're going to hire because of it. Experienced carpenters for the bridge work. We've got a lot of subcontractors moving earth, moving dirt, and they're going to be looking to hire local people as well. Hubbard Construction promises at least 100 jobs created or maintained by this project. The airport has even bigger expectations, predicting 265 new jobs. Lisa is just glad she got one of them. In Tampa, Eric, ABC Action News. If you're looking to hire, if you would like to look at the job postings, you can go to ABC Action News.